welcome back to Galactic Science with Nemgo. Are you ready for today's lesson, Ego? We're going to no, teach these viewers something. No, because if it's something? anything like your counting off camera. My counting off camera. Day one, night one, day one. No, it's definitely day two, isn't it? <laughs> De definitely want to. Uh, what? what? <laughs> one comes after two. No, that's right. One and two. It's currently night time on the moon. Ego has managed to build us the entire wall around the outside, which is good. But things can still get in. A few little things have managed They're to get in. They're actually spawning in. Someone, someone didn't do a adequate job of lighting. Oh, well, let me go and ask them a question. There's two spiders. They can definitely climb up on top, and they spiders can. Yeah. Yeah. Did you say you found a skelly? There was one. There's one behind you. Ah, oh, well. <laughs> the spiders are definitely all over the place, like, all over us. Wow, mm. they're really giving me a big beating as well, man, because I haven't got any armour on. Really, 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 really nasty gets. But... Do, 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 do. Yeah. But they can't get in a one-wide gap, so I can hit them from out here. So no, don't open a two-wide <coughs> gap. Don't do it, Ego. When don't they're in, it. they've got nowhere to... Uh... I can't hit you guys up there. Oh, I can't get them. Just have a little regen. So, yeah, night times on the moon are going to be very difficult. We're going to need to put, uh, like, a ceiling and get out. and all those kind of things. We're going to need to fortify ourselves a lot better than we are. Ow. Also, having oxygen producers and all that kind of stuff is a long way off because we currently don't have a lot of materials. Uh, we've got oh, a lot... Let's fight with a spider. We've got a lot of moon dirt, moon rock, and moon turf, thanks to Ego doing a bit of mining earlier on. Um, I'd just like to point out this. Started a little mine uh, down you know there. They, you know how they say that vegetables are healthy? Uh, but? This can of apples just killed that spider. You hit a, a spider with a can of apples? Yeah. Wow. That's awesome. That ain't healthy. <laughs> That's awesome. That's dangerous. That is awesome. Uh, I'm going to take some more torches and light up the areas that look exceedingly dark out here. Because obviously we are spawning them out here a little bit as well. But F7 wasn't working when I put the torches down, so... No, still not working. Don't blame me completely. Uh, Where is... I've lost my can. You've lost your can? You know when you have food. Oh yeah, you get the aluminium can back when you've eaten it. Well, never, never mind. Uh, what we've been doing then is sieving. Mm. We've been sieving stuff. So oh, I took full damage. You took full damage from what? I don't know. Uh, from falling. <laughs> from falling. <laughs> uh. Okay, so from an ex nihilio sieve, we've got the recipes. Normal ex nihilio rules apply. Cave as well. Dirt gives us all these bits and pieces. Gravel gives us all these cool bits and pieces. Sand gives us all those cool bits and pieces. Soul sand gives us those bits. So we can sieve all those kind of things, normal vanilla-y type stuff. Um, but then we've got the moon dirt. So the moon dirt we've been picking up looks like it gives us a lot of the things similar to normal dirt. Except it's got blaze rods in it. Uh, which, is, which is cool, we get blaze rods. Moon rock gives us this clay, which is the only way we can get clay at the minute, and uh, diamonds as well. Also fallen meteors, which is quite cool, and some silicon so we can progress in Galacticraft. The moon turf, which is, we've had plenty of to start off with, gives us a 1% chance of getting ancient spores to make um, mycelium, I think it was. Uh, but the like first death in a minute. Well. <laughs> get back in then. The glowstone, I've been making glowstone torches uh, which is simply a stick on a glowstone I think it's probably just easier to show you in any eye because I haven't got any sticks on me uh, yeah there we go a stick glowstone gives us a glowstone torch or four glowstone torches which is what we've been lighting the area up with because you can't you can't whoa you can't put a torch down when there's no oxygen but a glowstone torch you can so we're okay and this fortification seems to be holding most of the mobs at bay at least uh, until Do I, I come over here and it. Or what? Uh, you know, the you know the things that blow up. Creepers, yeah. Yeah, they're down here and all. Yeah, I expected so. So we've got a spider who's trying to figure out how to climb up this wall. But the mobs at night time on the moon are lots and lots and lots, and the moon and the sun day cycles and all that kind of stuff are really, really extensive. Can I put a request in for a? 
Um, sword. A sword? Yes, I can make you a sword. Would you like a stone sword? No. Uh, like just a nickel plated diamond faced. I can't make you a shit. diamond sword just yet, unfortunately. Tight -fisted person. Uh, unfortunately, I can make I you. I build a... you a wall, and you won't even give me. I can make you a wooden sword. That's about no, no, it. No, no, no. Uh, the stone axe is probably doing more damage than a wooden sword would. Where are you? In a cave. In a cave. The cave. The cave downstairs. Okay, let's see about this jumping down three blocks at a time we need, business. We need thing though. Eh? We need uh, more torches. I haven't got any more glowstone at the minute. There you go. There's a sword flying at you. Uh, I like the way you, you really did make me a wooden sword. Yes, because I haven't it's made any same. stone yet. It's the same as an axe. We've got it. <laughs> it's the same damage as an axe. Yeah, but then you can use your axe for cutting wood. I like the stairwell up and down in this. That's awesome. Uh, right, more food. Fancy taking on the skelly. Have you taken on the skelly? Give me that time. Yeah. Well, go kill skellies then. I didn't, you know, hide behind a. Hide behind a what? Uh, we we need to get some more clay. The clay oh, was God. from moon rock, so I'm gonna quickly just sieve out some more of this because Bloody the hell, baby baby skelly baby. Oh, oh. <laughs> Ego's gonna have an adventure again. Uh, we we also need to make this oak barrel. Actually. That's what I'm here for, isn't it? Yeah, you do you do adventuring stuff. Um, oak barrel is that just that? Oh, I need one more piece, don't I? Not quite enough. There we go. Whoa! Uh, whoa! The um, baby zombies are on like some sort of like okay. speed. And baby zombies are on speed. Yeah. Uh, it's this stuff. Ah, it's a slab at the bottom. I can't even hit it. I think I've got it there. Keep taking out my torch. Okay, so that and that makes that. Yeah. And that should give us a quest reward. Yes, Dict uh, detection task is 10 dirt. So we've got to get 10 dirt for the detection task. Mm. Well. 10 normal dirt. 10 normal dirt, yes. Well, we've got three there. If I hack this up, I can get the dirt from underneath the trees as well. So we've been given quite a bit of dirt already. So I'll grab all that. And then put it back down afterwards. Why not? Uh-huh. And there's two over here. Uh, we've got enough string at the minute for us to not worry about the string trees anymore for a little bit anyway. Is that what we call them? String trees? String trees, yes. And uh, at some point we will have spiders all over the place. Whoa, 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 whoa. Speaking of spiders, one just snuck up behind me and started having a go. Knocked me up into the air. I think that's the worst part about fighting anything. They knock you about. Wow. Get out of it. Come on, come on. Do you believe you can fly? I can believe that I can bounce really, really high. As for flying, I'm not so sure about that one. Yeah, we've got a fire, fair bit of string. We've got some spider eyes as well. It's quite nice. Good, good. Uh, but I do need two more dirt to be made. So I'm going to take this half a stack of string and dump it into here. In fact, I shouldn't really have put that into into here in the first place. I should put that in the base. So at night time I can do this kind of stuff as well. Oh, the sieve? Yeah. 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 Didn't really think that for Put a that in there. I put the uh, put the barrel outside. Right, so fill that up. That'll get to compost down. It'll take a few minutes, but it'll compost down. And string is not the ideal choice, but... So where do we get... Um... Glowstone from again. Glowstone we got from the uh, turf. Uses of turf. Yes, we got glowstone from turf. So uh, I'll do some more turf to make some more glowstone lantern uh, torches for you. Thank you. There we go, caving. Yeah, have you found any cheese yet? No. There's cheese ore on the moon. Okay. Well, what is that for? Uh, making cheese. Moon cheese. The moon is made of cheese, remember? It's not. It's it made is. Of Wensleydale. Wensleydale is the name of cheese. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. What is it then? I have no idea. It's, it's a maker cheese, but I it, didn't really think this argument through at the you time. You didn't think that through, did you? It's not made of cheese, it's made of Wensleydale. That's like saying, no, it's not made of cheese, it's made of cheddar. Yeah. Or mozzarella. Yeah. Parmesan. Mmm. Mm. Mozzarella. Talking all the cheeses now. How many cheeses can you name? 
put down in the comments all the cheeses you can name, folks. Let's see who can <laughs> name the most cheeses without Googling it. Well, that's me and you, Alan. <laughs> we'll leave it to the viewers to decide. Well, i got a bit more glowstone. How, how are you doing? Have you got like a massive well, area down there? Not really. I don't know. It's really dark. So you can't see like, round I don't the corner. Think, you know, like our normal torch, just like something like 8 by 8 or whatever it is. Yeah. It? Do you think... These, uh, these, these torches don't. They, do like, they don't light up that much space. <laughs> Dang it. Okay. Well, I've nearly sifted through all of this turf, so I'll make oh us my a God. bunch of torches. Have you just found a big place? I've just found like the convention centre for the... <laughs> for mobs. Local mobs. <laughs> youth centre. Well, center. well, well, well. Youth well space. There? Space. Youth space of today. The final gone frontier. Here today, gone tomorrow. Okay, what I'll do for that, I think. I'll leave right, four Ooh, what's that? Oh, what's that? Oh, it's normal gunpowder. Flint, gunpowder, like, bones. Like, <laughs> uh huh. Oh, no! No! He's got me in the air! Oh, my God! It's, it's got you in your hair, did you say? In the air. Okay, I'll just check in that I heard that right, because I didn't hear it right, obviously. Right, I need to go back up. I need, I need torches. There's another dirt. Uh, supply is not good enough. I got your torches. I got you covered. I'll come down if you want. I just need to get some more piece of dirt going. I think bone meal might be able to go in there. I don't know. Uh, no, I can't bone meal into it. Never mind. Worth a shot. What about it's actual such a good idea. bones and seeds and stuff? Oh, I don't want to really get put the seeds in. I'm pretty sure I just jumped off that torch. Anyway. And there's no other materials that I can use. I'll get, just use some more string up. I just need one more dirt. Honey, I'm home. Hi. Do you want some glowstone torches in your face? Torches in your face. Got some arrows. Got some arrows. I don't want the stuff that's not sieved stuff in there. Thank you. Hmm? Don't want non-sieved stuff in there. Thank you. One more dirt. Decompose. Now. Do it. Ah, spider! I want, that's what I wanted. I want food. Have you run out of food already? No, but I'm going to. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Get out of my face. We need to put a roof on. That's that's what we need to do tomorrow during the daytime. Is put do a it. roof on An this place. An outer lip. Hey? An outer lip. An outer lip. Yes, that Put's would be working as well. That would also be a good idea. <laughs> it would also be a lot cheaper. <laughs> yeah, then water to taking the whole thing off. All right, have I got my ten dirt yet? Yes, I've got my ten dirt. And bing, you should get the quest for us as well. There is cans of food, saplings, and dirt. I'm going to claim the saplings because we're running uh, out. Right, so... If you claim the dirt, then we're good with that one. Done. Amazing. I can't be stopped. I know. We can get Finished. shears for that. Okay, clay. We need seven clay for that. We've already got the moon rock. Then we get seven clay. Crafting a pickaxe. There. there was a craft, crafting of stone pickaxe, but we already had that. Yeah, well. Uh, moon rock we've done, so clay is the next one. We need seven pieces of clay. And then we can work on getting the furnace. Okay. And what's this? A furnace. We've got to make a furnace once we've got some cobble. That gives us a coal generator, a backup energy supply. That's cool enough. That's cool. Um, but technically, coal shouldn't work. What? Well, coal shouldn't burn on the moon. Because? Because it needs oxygen. Uh-huh. And there's no oxygen. Uh-huh. So it shouldn't work. Uh-huh. That's today's lesson. Well, that is today's lesson, folks. Thank Nailed you it. Very much for watching. <laughs> <laughs> Galactic science with Nemgo. We are awesome, and we know our stuff. We know our science. We are totally down with science. We've both We're total got total like chemists. We have both got DHPs. We're both DHP in science, and especially um, space biology. I, I missed that class. I was off that day. Oh, you missed space biology. Okay. It, to be honest, it was kind of boring. Hey, you're setting off fireworks in the house again. Oh, I'm not. Oh, you got to eat ten charcoal. Well, that's hard. We've got How ten wood in there. We? We've got ten wood, haven't we? Have we got ten wood? <laughs> uh, we've got three charcoal already in here. 
So there's three towards it. I'll put that in the chest. Uh, right, after that, let's just sieve this up quickly. Get rid of this moon turf. We're going to have to do a lot of sieving to get some more stone and bits and pieces. And we need seven clay in total. So I'm going to need to sieve some of that moon rock. Where are you putting dirt? Outside? Outside at the minute, yeah. Just because that's probably where we're going to use it. I've got another potato. Got a potato. We've only got three clay. Hmm. Yeah, right. that doesn't seem to be... Uh... It doesn't come very quickly through the moon rock. The uses of moon rock um, for sieving gives us a 10% chance of getting a clay drop. It's slightly more than getting a diamond or lapis or anything else useful. It's still more than all that, but it, I don't think these add up to 100%, like there's a 100% chance of getting something, because I sieved a load of moon rock earlier and nothing happened. I'm also running out of oxygen again. Um, super. Tell us where the plane is. Hmm. It's not detecting unless I've got to have all ten. Yeah. You've got to have all ten. In you know, normally how it used to like do. Oh, you've got seven of the ten. Yeah, but not for that particular quest. Uh, I've got a coal generator. Yeah. Do I don't want? think we need it yet just yet, but it might be useful to put it somewhere close by for when we get the auto sieve made. So I'll then the auto put sieve it, can I'll put give it in us... the chest for the. Yeah, okay, good plan. Energy conduit. I'm up to five clay at the minute, so I'm going to just do a little bit more and then go and get some more oxygen. That's six. I need seven in total. And then we'll see about making this furnace. We've got plenty of bone meal to turn it into the pulse, pul pul whatever it is. There's, a, there's clay and then there's porcelain clay. That's it. When you put bone uh, meal on it, you make it We porcelain. need two more iron ore. I've got two more iron ore, broken iron ore. I've just thrown them out. I'll, I'll go next door and get them. <laughs> go next door and get them. Ask the creepers for them. There's the seven. Okay, I've got seven. Please, sir, can I have my iron Let's ore back? Let's have a look. We've done that one. You've done that and got us a coal generator, so I also get a coal generator. Very nice. We are generating them MR, uh, the MR. What the hell? Yeah. The RFs. Uh, the detection task was that. The next detection task is a block of coal. Got to get a block of coal. Okay, well... Let me just sieve that out of the way. I think I just got some lapis for that. That's cool. And, oh, man, I just got one more piece of coal as well. So we've just got enough for a block of coal. Awesome. That's another quest completed. Okay, then the claim reward. Get the bow meal. That's that one done. We Let's get some and rolling. Resources. Next for the crucible. I need to make a crucible, which I think is bow meal. I've got bow meal on me. Okay. So, da 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 Porcelain clay, yes. More. I have done, I have done the shears. More, more, more. Got Get the more food. Fired pot thing. It's that. It's a crucible that is fired. So I've got to do that in the furnace. Have you got any single bits of charcoal on you? No, I've just lobbed it all back. Okay, in the chest. I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. So, so you're uh, making the crucible, yeah? I'm burning. Well, I'm cooking the unfired crucible now to make the crucible Sweet. for the crucible quest. Now I'm going to. Uh, Go and get some leaves. Some food. leaves, okay. That is going to be something we need to do. Since That's the thing. Cheers. That's the thing. Uh, I'm going to put that coal back in as coal. There we go. We could also use barrels and things as well. Right, so we've got the crucible, so we can both claim the reward of the crucible as well. We get an empty canister, a bucket, and moon rock, moon turf, or sugar cane. We both get the sugar cane claimed. And then the powering up the oxygen you've done, that gets some more food. Awesome. Next, water. Water, essence of life. I'm quite astonished that I didn't feel thirst all the time since I'm here. But it won't hurt to get some water. I think I saw something useful sieved from that rock. That rock where? Uh, huh. Something useful sieved from that rock. Uh, what am I, sugar what am I, cane we, seeds? Am I getting sugar cane, did you say? I need a bucket of water. Yeah, because we can get the other two. Yeah, get the get the sugar cane. We're surrounded by the other two. Yeah, so we've got to make... We need water to put the sugar cane on here. That'll be a thing, won't it? So we need to get some more iron. Right. Um, but how are we making... How are we making the water? That's the thing. Now, I'm pretty sure it was something to do with a crucible and a heat source. 
uh, uses of a crucible. Uh, just decomposing. Uh, water in a crucible. It's like leaves or something decomposing. Uh, we've in a got a bucket. Not we've mine. got a bucket. Yeah, we've got a bucket each. Right, have you got the crucible? I've got the crucible, yeah. Could I have the crucible? Have you got something to put underneath it to make it I've got rock? An idea. You're going to try a glowstone torch as a heat source. It's going to be amazing. If it works, it's going to be amazing, yeah. Yes. And then we put stuff in it and it should break down into stuff. You can't put leaves in it and you can't put softens in it. It did say something about sieving rock. Uh, let's have a look at the rock sieve. That's the clue it gave us. Uh, right, so... <laughs> well, it drops ice, doesn't it? It does. <laughs> so all we have to do is just get that ice that we got, break it, and we've got water. Just yeah, put it on simple. the floor and break it, and I'll pick it up with the water. With the hat and bar hand? Uh, well, with anything, I think. Yeah, there we go. Got some water. Nailed it. Nailed it. Job done. Right, let's get some water sources in here. Uh, we'll just do them as we go, and then we can grow a bit of sugar cane down the sides here as well. This will be a little sugar cane farm. I uh, got two pieces. So sieving for ice was a thing. That'll work it. And then the more ice we can get, the better. You could put a couple more down there, but I think we'll just put water down the sides here. I want to do some growing of crops as well, so we can put some dirt and use some of these seeds that we've picked up like we've got wheat seeds we've got grass seeds we've got cactus seeds we've got pumpkin seeds i might put a cactus somewhere yeah. place that. pumpkins yeah we can get a couple of pumpkins we can get some wheat seeds growing we can use the acorn that makes an apple tree doesn't it acorn or does that make a spruce tree i can't remember which way around it works it makes a tree I know it makes a tree, but which tree? I can't remember. Tree uh, tree. A tree tree. But, yeah. I know it was a bit wrong because... Well, ah, spider. Been tracking me. <laughs> a bit wrong. A bit wrong spider. because the spider tracking me. Uh, yeah. It's a bit wrong because it's an acorn tree and it made a tree of a different type. It's an acorn that doesn't make a... Ah, an oak tree. I think. Maybe it does make an oak tree. I don't know. Welcome to Galactic Science with Nemgo. We know what we're talking about. We know exactly what's going on. We know all about these things. Of course we do. Yeah, I need three dirt. You're dropping leaves all over the place. No, they're just like about four hours behind. <laughs> they're all over the place. Okay, on. so we can go four blocks away from the water. One, two, three, four. So let's take... Uh, this one out. Going deep underground. This then. one out. And this one out for the farm stuff. You're going deeper underground, are you? Kind of scared. Oh my god, and it's creepers are, Ross. You've got lots of creepers down there. I want to come and see, but I don't at the no, same time. No, you don't. No, no, no. I, I, I kind of I don't want to see what you're doing. Because there's all sorts of nasty things down there. And I'd rather you just kept dying rather than me dying. Oh, kept dying would imply that I'd already died, but I haven't already. Well, people will be also seeing our monthly modded Minecraft challenge, won't they? And they will know that I am a professional in the art of making myself look bad. Yes. Yes. Uh, we've got... And I do that as a friend to you make do... you look good. <laughs> you do that to make me look good. Yes, thank you very much for that. Sure. Much appreciated. Uh, let's put some rotten flesh in that barrel. Much appreciated, my friend. Much appreciated. Yes. Um, right, well, have we got anything else to set up and sort out? I can claim potatoes from the water claim bucket. Potatoes. From the, getting the water bucket, okay. the water essence of life, we can claim potatoes. We also get some reward bag and stuff from that as well. Reward bag. Maybe that's got a diamond sword in it. Hot sauce. When you have the ability to get water, you should look for lava too. Perhaps I could throw something in a crucible. <gasps> what? Yeah, and then but we how can... are we going to heat the crucible? Well, I think the torch idea might work. I'm hoping the torch no, idea says, will work. Oh, uh, well, and then just because we didn't have anything in it, it wouldn't... We didn't put anything in it, yeah, speed. that's fine. I'm going to check the reward bag as well. You never know what we're going to get. Cans of food. <coughs> More cans of food. 
Well, we really don't need a food farm with all these cans of food we've got lying around. No, we don't. However, I do need oxygen because I'm about to run out and I've only just noticed. Mm, that is a good point, that. Yeah, got to make sure you keep your oxygen supply up. Oh, I uh, want to go down there uh, now. Right, no. Executive decision. Got to come back. Got to come back for the oxygen. Don't be uh, don't be exhausting your oxygen supply while you're down there. It's going to make it very difficult to do anything if you've run out of oxygen. Uh huh. Okay, so we need stone. We've got a bit of stone there. Where do we get the stone from? We can uh, Bob. sieve normal dirt for six with a lot of chance of getting it. We can sieve moon dirt for a hundred percent chance of getting it. So moon dirt gives us a hundred percent chance of dropping a single nugget of stone every time, apparently. Okay. Apparently, yeah. So uh, moon dirt. We got turf. We haven't got dirt. Got a little forest going on here. I got some moon dirt. You got some dirt. Okay. Wee! I love the way it floats across the place. Right. I need. I need quite a bit of cobble to make this a bucket of lava. I think it's like four cobble per lava or something daft like that, isn't it? Um, yeah, something silly. You've got to put quite a few in the crucible. Speaking of the crucible, can you set it back up again if you still got it? Oh, my... Because oh, uh, you to took it down, didn't you? Yeah, I'll have to make it. Just used all the torches you made. I'm torching it. Uh, torching it, yeah. And then we put lava under it once the torch is done as uh, yeah, a bucket make the of lava. One. Yeah, that should have worked for us. Um, Are you keeping up, viewers? Is it nice and simple for you? I think it is just about our level at the minute. You wait until we get into some more techie stuff. Wow. The, the the stuff I've seen that in this mod pack already are blowing my mind. I don't know anything about a lot of them, and they all look really awesome. Can't wait to get into the wiki and find out what they actually do. But right now, have no idea. This is just like basic sky blocking, ex nihilio, crash landing stuff to start off with. We will have all of the high, high sci fi tech stuff coming soon. You know, just got to survive these first few days and nights. Uh, what are we on day yet? Has the sun come up? I don't know. No, because it's like forever, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it is forever. But is it is it anywhere near yet? How long have we been recording? Four hours and 27 minutes. Uh-huh. And uh, this is night one of galactic science. Well, I've got a fair bit of cobble available now, though, so that's good. All right, let's just throw the rest of that away in there. Oh, you just brought a load more stuff back as well. Good job, man, good job. Right, so these should just make into stone like that. Make it a cobble. I could make a cobble Tell hammer. You what, this uh, spider's One, obsessed with you. Two, three, four. Is it a thousand solid cobblestone? Melting speed is currently zero. Hmm. It says zero right now. So that torch doesn't seem to be doing enough for that job. Sorry to say, that doesn't seem to have worked. How so, about we use flint and steel and just keep making a fire underneath it? Yeah, we could try that. Uh, let's have a look at blaze rods as well. we got a zombie in the base. Um, yeah, we could burn wood underneath it. We could, yes, we could do that. Don't know if it works, but it sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan. There's possibly Whoa. also something we could decompose in the future to make it as well. Do I get any points for knocking a zombie out of the base? Whoa! You're you gone. knocked him out of the base. Well, yeah. we can play golf with zombies a bit later on if you want. That might be fun. <laughs> I remember, uh, I think it was Generic B set up a golf on the moon at one point. Do you not use villagers or something? Uh, no, it's using a, a bunny or something like that. I don't know what it was that you were using yeah. to hit. Something that regenerated very quickly was used. And uh, then you just give it a smack and it flies around. Uh, flint and steel. Do we have what it takes to make iron? Yes, somewhere. But there's no Got more no of the crushed iron ore. Whoa! Dang it. Okay, so you got that from rock. You know what I said about playing thing with the... You get it from rock. So I'm going to do this moon rock. 
Uh, with the zombies. Put the I'm probably on. just going to sieve the rest of this stuff out. Have we got anything else to show the viewers this episode? Or no, done, I, th I, think, I think we're done. Okay, well, thank you all up. very, very much for watching. Night one on the moon in galactic science with Nemgo. We're going to get busy, busy, doing some more sieving. I need a flint and steel to start this fire off to get the first bucket of water. And I also want to sieve all of this stuff that Ego's been mining. And presumably Ego will want to go mining again <gasps> to get some more stuff. So I'll put the freaking oxygen. Yeah. Put the freaking oxygen in your tank now. <laughs> so until next episode, folks, thank you very much for watching Galactic Science with Nemgo. We'll see you next time. Say goodbye. Bye guys. Ah, be to it. <laughs>